Good afternoon, this is John from Two Dust Bees and Gardens. Today, I'm going to be putting a Beetle Buster baseboard in place on this hive here in front of me. I have a video where I talk about the various types of hive beetle control, and here in Texas, we have our fair share of small hive beetles. I'll put a link to that video up here in the upper corner, and I'll also put a link to it down in the description for those that can't seem to see the link above. I have a number of Beetle Buster baseboards, and I would say they are probably the best solution for dealing with small hive beetles in a hive that I've come across. And I've tried a number of methods of controlling the hive beetles. One thing I want to say is that you don't necessarily have to have a Beetle Buster baseboard for all your hives, but you want a Beetle Buster baseboard in your arsenal of beekeeping tools. If you run into a situation where you have a small, where you have small hive beetles and they take over or take control or become a real problem for your, one of your hives, it's real easy to take it out and put it in place on your hive that's got the problem, put DE in the bottom tray and walk away. Come back a little later, a day or so, maybe a week, and you'll be amazed at how fast the hive can take care of the beetles in that hive using the Beetle Buster baseboard. It's pretty incredible. For my money, the Beetle Buster baseboard is a must have tool and worth its weight in gold. Here's how we install from start to finish a Beetle Buster baseboard on an active beehive. We hope you enjoy the show. Thank you. 